our next question is question 13th and this one you see if the head of the cockroach is removed it may live for few days and as per your book almost a week it is able to live so what is the reason that even a decapitated cockroach survives so the reason for it that if you see their nervous system a very little part of the nervous system is in the head region the majority of it is in the body and you know that in case of invertebrates it's on the ventral side so if you see the choices here so the, in the second choice the head holds a small portion of a nervous system while the rest is situated along the ventral part of its body so this is absolutely correct explanation for their survival even after the head is severed right so this gives us the correct answer as option 2 so with this we can move on to our next question that is question number 14th now in this question select the correct events that occur during inspiration now inspiration you know is a active process in which there is contraction of the diaphragm which flattens from a dome shaped structure there is contraction of our intercostal muscles the external intercostals so that the rib cage is pulled outward and upward as a result the thoracic volume it increases and the pressure decreases so let us see what all is there so contraction of the diaphragm that's absolutely correct contraction of external intercostal muscles this is also correct but next thing you see pulmonary volume decreases now this is opposite and intrapulmonary pressure that is pressure inside the lungs that is increases it is writing so that's also wrong because volume increases and pressure decreases so it is only a and b which are correct and that out of the options we can see is in the fourth one right so our correct answer is option four so with this we can move to our next question that is question number 15th so here we have question 15th by which method was a new breed hisardale of sheep formed by using bicanary eaves and merino rams now bicanary is a indigenous breed of sheep that is the breed which is found in our country and merino is one of the highest yielding breed of sheep which is reared for wool good quality wool and this is actually a spanish breed but now it has become part and parcel of australia now when two different breeds the eve that is the female sheep and ram that is the male sheep they are mated so this is certainly a case of cross breeding and this is done by animal breeders in animal husbandry so that the productivity can be increased and so the answer here of course is cross breeding so this way option 2 is the right answer now from here we can move on to our next question which is question 16 which one of the following is the most abundant protein in the animals now this is a direct textbook question from biomolecules and the most abundant protein in the animal world is of course collagen so we can mark this here and this is the correct answer that we have so from here we can move ahead to the next questions